and my main focus is how do we rebuild Geelong after COVID and making sure that our residents really embrace what is about shop local and buy local. Um, we want to make sure our tourism campaigns are up to date and we want to make sure that all of our policies and procedure are in place for city to be able to support Geelong. There's a whole range of uh, community expectations uh, for, I guess, achievements for the next four years. So I guess until we sit down and look at uh, or revisit some of those plans, um, and uh, be guided by the communities to uh, what we start with and finish with. Look, I think it's, it's the group coming together and, and working out uh, ourselves what, what are the main issues. Uh, I don't think I've got a main issue myself, but it's, it's what the group come up with and we uh, finally sit down as a, as a group. One of the major issues facing our community, especially in the Ballerine, is COVID recovery, trying to recover from our tourism industry, our arts, our hospitality, to revitalise what's important and what makes the Ballerine unique. So we can get that going up and at the same time balancing the council budget for infrastructure needs across all communities. The main focus for me at this stage will be to ensure that we fast track some of the critical processes to get businesses back on deck, particularly the tourism and hospitality industry around the Ballerine. I really hope we have a, a really good COVID recovery and that uh, my pr prime focus will be making sure the shared trails get quite prominence and uh, the livestock exchange is actually finished this year. My uh, first priority will really be looking at how we can better engage the community on some of the really big issues that are facing our municipality, in particular uh, the environment and climate change. And the most thing I'm looking forward to over the next four years is working together with my fellow councillors uh, to make sure we get the infrastructure that is critically needed in our area because more and more people are out walking due to, due to the COVID restrictions. So we need to make sure we've got the footpaths and the crossings and, and things to make people more healthy and dog parks and things like that. I'm also going to be excited to address the draft sustainability framework, which is in the interest of Franklin, so that's going to be my first point of business at Council. I have a strong focus and commitment to my community in the north, and I will continue to advocate for them and be a strong voice um, in the city of Greater Geelong.